Hi, and welcome to Discover, the brand new show on MSU TV. This show is dedicated to teaching you new students all you need to know about your brand new hometown, Moorhead. I'm your host, Nathaniel Watkins, and we have an exciting first episode for you. We're going to have three special interviews. First, we'll interview Joel Cordial about a new film project he has coming up. Shelby Hester about her participation in intramural sports, and finally, Jackson Hurt about a new play being put on by Moorhead's own theater company. Please stick around, and we'll be back to Discover. Welcome back. I'm here with our first guest, Joel Cordial. Joel, what are you here to talk to us about? I'm here to talk about a film I'm going to be making here in October called The Anthropophagus of Appalachia. Oh, wow. That's a lot. So you're a filmmaker. Did you come here to MSU? I did. I came here in 2013. Um, I, my declared major was CVM. I did have a, a really deep interest in uh, film filmmaking. Um, the first film that I actually made, it was a part of a film group here on campus called ZBT. Mm -hmm. And that the first film I helped out was called Shattered, and that was back in uh, spring of 2015. We participated in the Moorhead State Film Challenge, and I think we got third place for that. Third place. That's impressive. And so tell us a little bit about what it was like to participate in the Moorhead Film Festival. Um, I've, I think I've participated in it a few times, actually. But the first time, uh, that was quite the experience. They premiered it in the local theater. And definitely your nerves are on in. Like, <laughs> You go from, you're given, I think, 48 hours to make the whole film. Yeah. So from the moment you get the title, and or not the title, but the genre, the line of dialogue, and basically what, um, like a prop and something like that, yeah. from the moment you get that, you have until maybe Monday morning to make the film. Wow. So you have to shoot it and edit it all before that Monday morning, and then they premiere it that Monday evening at the local theater, wow. which that's how they worked it back then. And um, leading up to that, like <laughs> your nerves are all, are all yeah. over the place because you're one running on no sleep, you're running on basically monster energy drinks, and you know just yeah. your, that's that's it. Um, that and all the energy building up to that. So you do have energy. You want to see it go like work out the way you hoped, and it's a lot of fun. Yeah. So back to the film you're working on. We were talking a little bit before. Are you looking for some people for that? I am. I'm going to be looking for a couple of actors, uh, hopefully a male and a female. And I'm going to be looking for a few productions, uh, production assistants, um, mainly people to just help out with audio, lighting, that type of thing. Um, but as far as actors go, I'm looking for a female and a male. Uh, they're going to be playing fraternal twins, so around the same age group. Something like that. They're going to be attending the same college that's along the storyline. Hey, that's really awesome. Thank you so much for being on, Joel. Come back a little bit and discover some more. Hi, welcome back. I'm here with our second guest, Shelby Hester. So, Shelby, what are you on here to talk about? Uh, intramurals. Intramurals. So, is that intramural sports here at MSU? Yes. So which intramurals did you participate in? Because um, I know there's a lot of events. I participated in soccer, dodgeball, volleyball, and I'm currently participating in powder puff. Currently participating in powder puff. So that's really cool. How do you get involved in intramurals? How do you sort of sign up? What's that process um, like? I've signed up through my sorority. We'll um, put out a team. Our campus involvement chair will ask who's involved. And if we get the maximum or the minimum number of players, we'll put a team together and pay the fee. and enroll into the t tournament. So when you enroll, do you have to do it by like a form? Do you go online? How do you sort of sign up? Um, it's through an app. How big do the teams have to be? Um, it just depends on the sport. Most of the time it's around 10, maybe 15 people. 10 to 15 people. And so do you have to be involved with the sorority or can any group of friends do it? Any group of friends can do it. I've done it with uh, a bunch of music people before called the Baird Ballers. <laughs> Uh, it's just we're just a bunch of friends who just got together and decided we wanted to do the soccer. All right, soccer. And so, how many sports would you say that they have involved in the intramural program? Oh my goodness, they probably have at least thirty to forty. Thirty to forty sports. Wow, that's crazy. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for being on. Come back after this, and we will discover some more. <laughs> 
I'm here with our final guest for today, Jackson Hurt. So Jackson, what are you here to tell us about today? So today I'm here to talk a little bit about Moorhead's theater program as well as uh, the upcoming production, Terra Nova. Alrighty, so what's it like being a member of Moorhead State's theater program? It's actually a, a pretty cool experience because Moorhead prepares you in at least two areas of expertise, whether that be lighting and acting or scenic design and lighting. Um, you know, you get a, a good array of, of choices um, to do and they train you for technical aspects as well. Yeah. So like, what would you say goes into each of those? So lighting, set design? Um, so there are classes offered for each of those areas, which is really cool. Um, you know, some schools just have acting, some schools just have tech, but we, we have a little bit of both. All right, that's cool. So like, how, which do you do? So I am the scene design, uh, less of the design and more just I build the sets. So um, it's a cool opportunity we get to work study. Um, as actors and tech people work in the costume shop as well as the scene shop and we design and help build the sets and costumes. All right, that's really cool. So I know you've worked a little bit on this upcoming program, mm -hmm. Terra Nova. Can you tell us a bit about that? So Terra Nova is a play written by Ted Talley about five Englishmen who were on a race with the Norwegians to the South Pole. Um, it's all about their camaraderie and their bravery, uh, braving the elements and um, in a race with the Norwegians. All right, so are you in this program? I am. I am actually playing uh, Bill Wilson. I am the doctor of the five. Um, I was actually the first doctor to reach the South Pole in the, in the show, um, which is a pretty cool experience to be able to play. Yeah. So is there any other programs looking past Terra Nova that MSU is working on right now? Yes, we also auditioned uh, a couple weeks ago for Ghost the Musical, and we should be hearing results relatively soon. Man, that's super cool. So is there anything you'd like to say to people who want to get experience in the theater program or in even just the plays and musicals here at MSU? Yes, if anybody wants to get involved, uh, it is not just open to theater majors. It is open to all kinds of majors. You can audition, help in the shops, um, anything. You can really get involved, which is, which is cool. Hey, that's really cool. So is there any advice you would give to people who are thinking about auditioning for these plays? Absolutely. Um, there's no reason to be afraid. Uh, the professors in the theater department really work with you and uh, for you, and they're really rooting for you. You know, no one's, no one's against you in the program. Um, and it's a really cool experience because, um, you know, you get audition experience for the real world. Mm -hmm. And so what are the dates for Terra Nova in case anyone at home wants to go? So Terra Nova shows uh, September 27th through the 30th, as well as October 4th through the 7th. So it's a Thursday through Sunday show, two weeks. All right, that's awesome. Thanks for coming on. Come back to Discover. Thank you all for tuning in to the first episode of MSU TV's brand new show, Discover. I'd like to give a sincere thank you to all of our guests, Joel Cordial, Shelby Hester, and Jackson Hurt. Once again, I'd like to thank you all for watching and tune in in the same time, same place next week to Discover. Thanks for watching.